Hello YouTube and welcome back to more Pokemon Stadium 2. I'm your host as always, Zephyr Sonic, and so in the last episode, we completed the entire Poke Cup where we defeated the Master Ball last time. And so yeah, all the Poke Cup is defeated, and now we only have one more cup left here in the stadium, and that is the Prime Cup, which there is no Poke Great Ultra Master Ball, just one Prime Cup section, and that's it before the round one finale. So, the ultimate tournament without level restrictions, let it all hang out. So, it's levels 1 to 100, so you, your opponent's levels are always going to be 100, but you can bring in less than 100 if you want to, but I don't know why you'd want to do that. Maybe for a challenge, I guess. So let's go ahead and take on the Prime Cup. So, I have selected my team, and it's all a raised team set from Pokemon Gold. And so we are now ready to take on the last cup here in the Pokemon Stadium, which is the Prime Cup. A battle? Certainly. Okay, so I think we're going to go with here my Heracross. Alakazam, and uh, my Charizard. Looks like they're ready to get started with the Pokemon Tournament Prime Cup. Which trainer will emerge as the champ in this tournament with absolutely no level restriction? Now, this cup is not to be taken lightly. It is a tough cup. So, we're going to go ahead and go right off of the Mega Horn. And so, yeah, that hurt quite a bit. Underground, uh, I'm not worried about it. So as you miss, uh... The other one looks Should tired. get you down for a horn attack. What's next? Yes, it's a hit. Now it goes. You'll be surprised, uh. What Pokemon will appear next? For those of you guys that are new to Pokemon Stadium 2, you'll be surprised what the last trainer has. Because I definitely remember what he's got. It's a fierce battle. Okay, so. It's a Togetic. And even though we are mismatched, uh, we're going to go for it. Just going to go for a horn attack. What not? Hit. That was good. Did some pretty good damage. So I'm happy with that. Double edge. There's the attack. That was a glancing blow. Doesn't look like, it doesn't look like it's got any flying moves, so... They're both hanging I mean, I'm pretty safe. The first battle's not too difficult. A light pass. Whoa, ah, now you go up in the air. A hot battle is unfolding. Well, just in case, I don't think Togetic's fly will be enough to take me out unless he gets a critical. But we're going to endure to be on the safe side. The Alright, 66. That should that should set the stage for reversal to at least take out Togetic. Wow. So Wigglytuff. I definitely um. Oh, actually waits. Endure most definitely. That way we can more than likely one hit KO it with uh, a reversal. Uh, please no paralysis. Alright, good. So one reversal and that should be it. So that is battle one. 
Pokemon. And there goes the battle. So sorry, Terry. Well, we just beat ya. My poor Pokemon, yes. <sighs> Alright, we're ready to go after Battle 2. And I remember this guy. The, uh... Hiya! I dedicated my life to fighting Pokemon. Yeah, the Black Belts. Yang. Alright, so definitely going to be Alakazam here. Um, and then we're gonna go with my Seabreeze Suicune and my Rocky. Actually, Rocky's a little bit of a risk. Because it is weak to fighting types, so... But first off is Hypmochan. I wouldn't be surprised at all if you switch, yeah. Wobbuffet. Oh, it's gotta be Wobbuffet. Oh, it's Wobbuffet. Buffet. Huh. Here's the first move. Oh, that didn't do much. All right, so I need to develop a strategy here. Uh. Alright, I think I got a plan. I'm gonna go ahead and go for a Thunder Punch. Hopefully it doesn't do too much damage. Alright, I think we should be fine. Okay, safeguard, okay. That might have been a little too much. That might have been. Um. Alright, I'm just gonna go for a Psychic because it won't do as much. So if it goes for a oh oh oh, be very careful, be very careful. <sighs> All right, um, I'm gonna go ahead and switch into my sea breeze. And uh, make it rain. Still Destiny Bond. Sorry, but I'm not attacking you. More Destiny Bonds. Well, I'll just wait until you run out. So I'll just keep uh, getting my Rain Dance set up. It it'll reset it if you use it again. So one sure surf should be able to do it combined with the power of Mystic Water. It's a good thing Destiny Bond's not a first turn move. So too bad for you, Buffet. Hitmon Lee. Well, we will take Hitmon Lee on. We'll detect. Okay, good for you. Yeah, that's another thing I was gonna say is that he does like to use detect quite a bit. And high jump kick, uh, should take it pretty well. Yeah, pretty much. And then finish you off with Ice Beam. Alright, so 
going down. He's okay, so as his last one is him on top. Pokemon remain. He's probably going to detect again. This Pokemon is rejoining the battle. This is the last Pokemon. The rain finally stopped. So we'll go back for the rain dance. Yeah, figured. But that's why I went for the rain dance the first turn. Because I knew he was going to detect. They're both hanging top. Continue. So I'll just wait for him to resurface. Now one more. Whoop, that missed. What next? That was a glancing blow. And now we shall finish you off. Too bad for you, Yang. This must be some sort of mistake. Uh, no, no mistake. And we're ready for battle three. Going up against the bird catcher. Taking proper care of bird Pokemon is rewarding. Yes. Rewarding when it's shocking. Alright, so definitely want to go with my Alakazam here. Um, we're gonna go with Rocky as well. And my uh, Suicune. Alright, so this shouldn't be too hard. Alright, so the first up is a Dodrio. And Alakazam can learn the elemental punches in the second uh, generation. So, okay. go with the Thunder Punch. Not sure if it's going to be enough to KO it, but... <laughs> yeah, all, all almost, but uh, yeah. Oh, and you missed. So, awesome. KO dead bird. Yeah. Because I said so, Mr. Bug Catcher. Oh, bug Catcher. I meant uh, Bird Catcher. So dealing with a Charizard now again, Thunder Punch. That was pretty good for a flamethrower, too. A hot battle is unfolding. Then I'll give you a good old psychic attack. A psychic blast! Great hit! Oh, and down it goes! Is there any way of stopping this incredible Pokemon form? So the last one is Gliger. Well, I didn't put Ice Punch on it, so, because I wanted to have Recover for if I needed it. And so, we will have our uh, third continue. So, just gotta finish this one off. The finishing blow. And that's battle three. There are no more remaining Pokemon. And there goes the battle. So, 
So, too bad. Adam! I don't care. So what if I lost? I still like bird Pokemon. Well, good for you. Time for battle four. So it's the cool female. I'm not gonna pull any punches. Ready? All right, looking at this team. I think I know exactly who I'm going to go with. We're gonna go with uh, my... We're gonna go with my uh, Heracross Alakazam. And we are gonna go with my uh, Charizard. The battles are intensifying to a fever pitch. This is round four. All right, so first up is gonna be Stantler. Both get ready to go. Now, come on, Mega Horn. Mega Horn. A crushing blow. It went down as soon as the battle started. Wow, Mega Horn. I nicknamed it Mega Horn because it's a signature move. And it's awesome. The number of remaining Pokemon is three to two. A serious attack. That's it. It's singing. Alright, come on, dodge it. Yes. Unfortunately for you, Clefable. There's the shot. Hit that one. You going down. Down it goes. This has turned into a one-sided battle. Oh, it hit the And so finally a Sipno. Should be an easy target for my Heracross. And I got a critical, so that's it for Battle 4. Man, doesn't here across rule? Took out, took all three of them out like it was nothing. Arg, I won't forgive you for this. So that is half the battles. All right, so first half of the battles are done, and now let's take on the second half with battle five. Against the Fisher Dude, which is the key in fishing, equipment or skill? The answer is both. Fisherman Chase. Alright, Alakazam is basically my electric type uh, Pokemon because he has got Thunder Punch on oh, it. Um. I think we're gonna go with uh, Wigglytuff, my Heracross, and Alakazam. Tough stuff. Alright, so first up is going to be uh, Lantern. I'm pretty sure he's gonna go for a Thunder Wave, so. That's why I'm hoping I maybe get him on a Paralysis with the Body Slam. He's gonna get to go first. He oh, goes for a Whirlpool. Alright, let's see if we can get a Paralysis. Yes, and I got a crit. Nice. Ah, okay, Miracle Berry, so. The white hot battle continues. Now he's gonna go for the surf. What now? The hit plant right off. 
And we might get him with a double edge. Maybe. Alright, yes, got him. Yeah, I sure did lose lose it. The next Pokemon needs to be prepared. Oh, it's a dugong. dugong. Well, we will keep up with the body slams. Even though he's gonna get to attack first. What to do? Does he have faster speed than me? But we can change that if we get a paralysis. Yes! And then I'm gonna go for a Hyper Beam to finish off that Dugong, hopefully. So, yes! Now that really is tough stuff. Montine. Well, considering I have to recharge, we will just have to wait waterfall. Well, we are going to go ahead and try to preserve this continue. And go into Alakazam. So far, we've got to continue on everyone so far. And this one's about to be next. So yeah, barely survived. So, one more Thunder Punch, and that will do it for Battle 5. Trust me, if you're using our rentals, it can definitely be a lot harder than this in this cup. Arg! Just couldn't pull it off. You weren't even close. Let's go after Battle 6. And against the evil scientist. Pokemon research is very extensive. Alright, now this guy is gonna be a little tough, Craig. I think we're gonna go here with my uh, my Alakazam, um, Rocky, and my Heracross. Round six is about to get underway. Many trainers have fallen by the way, leaving just eight to reach the quarterfinals. Trust me, Alakazam can be a very big asset in this cup. All right, so first is Electrode, and, uh... Wondering what you're gonna do. Swagger. Look at that swagger. Well, let's see if we can get this off. Ha, <laughs> good. Okay, couldn't get it off. All right, we're gonna go ahead and switch to, uh, right on. See what he plans to do next. Nice oh, <laughs> screech. screech. Not that it really bothers my ride on any. There, he bet that went down. And if you use a swagger, that'll really help. Really will, so I'm pretty sure, yeah, he's gonna go back again for it. It's not, a swagger's not 100% accurate. It's like 95, yeah, and he missed. So one earthquake and, uh, shabam. Ooh, 
What? What Pokemon will appear next? So what's his next? Crobat. No. So come on, Rocky, we can uh, fight this off. Yes. Very nicely done, Rocky. What's this? The hit lands right off. All right, not worried about it. Good, that's good. One Pokemon is still capable of going up, but the other one looks tired. There's the attack. Come on, Rocky. Fight it off. Ah. Nope, it still can't move. There's a big HP. Oh, we still got, uh... We still got some time before you can take my ride on out. Oh, critical. Come on. Oh, wow. Well. In that case, we're going to go ahead and go into uh, Heracross. That was ridiculous there. Now, hopefully I can get my quick attacks, or my uh, quick claw to kick in. I don't, and he flies up in the air. I would think my hair, cro my hair cross should be able to brace this unless it crits. Maybe? Ah, no, I don't. My quick claw didn't kick in, which uh, would have been a really big help. So it's no problem, we'll go back into Alakazam. And that, uh, yeah, Crobat is fast. Alright, Alakazam, come on, we gotta shake this off. Yes! <laughs> oh la la. Just one Pokemon remains. Oh, it's nine tickets. This is the last Pokemon. Alright, definitely gonna save. Um, Pokemon is two to one. The tenth battle continues. Alright, um. <sighs> Alright, we'll go for it. Aha! Yes. No Thank more. you. There it goes. We should be good, I think. And he missed, so... Alright. Um, I'm assuming he's gonna go back for the Confuse Ray. So... This would be a lovely time for a crit. Don't get it. And... Just to ensure that no nothing messes up, if my Rodong gets taken out, it gets taken out. This way, if my run on does get taken out, I can bring back in Alakazam, Speed Advantage, and Kapow. So it's no biggie if Rhydon uh, gets KO'd. So, come on, right on. Can we do it? Alright, yes. And that's it for Battle 6. That was pretty close, scientist. You almost had me.
This too is a possible outcome. I have to accept this. Yes, you do. So, five continues. Here comes battle seven. So it's the skier. Do you play any winter sports? No, I don't. Okay. Well. I think we're gonna go with, um... With Heracross, Wigglytuff, and Alakazam. So, first up is going to be Lapras. Right here across, I'm counting on you. <laughs> awesome! Alright, so even though the icy one is going to lower my speed if it hits, let's... Well, there goes the 5% accurate that missed. Because it's only 95 accurate. Ah, we missed. What that? That was a glancing blow. The crowd's excitement is building from this heated battle. All right, come on, Airgross, we can do it. There's the attack. Ah, oh, two again. Mega Horn misses in a row. What do I do? A light hit. All right, now I think I'm just gonna. I think I can go for a reversal. Finish you off from there. What's that? Well, I don't know if it's. Yeah, it wasn't enough damage. Alright, uh, let's see what happens. Alright. Um, it's a bit of a risk, but. I'm gonna endure. Oh boy, no paralysis. I went for the ender. Well, there, it endured that attack. Are both Pokemon running out of steam? I was hoping she would have. Well, she, there now she goes for another ice beam. I was hoping she would have done that. The last turn, instead of body slam. So in comes Alakazam then. To finish uh, you off, a Lapras. Oh, oh, We're eagerly awaiting the appearance of the next Pokemon. Oh, it's Slowking! Slowking! Well, we do have the uh, Thunder Punch. Pokemon remain on each side. Alright, pretty good damage. Shadow Ball, ooh. Psst, yeah, that was quite a bit. Um, alright, we're gonna switch into to, uh, Wigglytuff because Shadow Ball will have no effect. And I want to take out that Slow King at all possible. So again, as I said, Shadow Ball, no effect. I'm gonna go for a Body Slam, maybe get some Paralysis on it. Yes, got it. All right, now I'm gonna think I'm gonna go ahead and go for a double edge. Double edge attack. That's it. 
<laughs> so yes. Oh, and down it goes. That's what you expect from tough stuff. There's only one Pokemon left to come up. Oh, it's the Raligator. Raligator. This is the last Pokemon. The heated action continues. Go for a body slam, even though he's gonna go for a screech. A horrible screech. No, the move and he missed. Failed. So, what's this? A light pack. And then I think I'm gonna go ahead and go for a hyper beam. See if we can't finish him off. What's that? Oh no, that didn't <laughs> work either. Again, missed. Well. Well, we both missed. Interesting. Alright, so he finally got me with the Screech. And, uh, see what happens? Alright, then I think I'm gonna go ahead and go for the Hyper Beam. A Slash. Well, tough stuff, do your stuff. And that's it for Battle 7. The last Pokemon goes down. And there goes the battle. So, one battle left. Oh, I lost. Oh well, no biggie. So just one battle left. Five continue. So one battle left in the Prime Cup that will complete the whole Pokemon Stadium after we defeat it. We are now ready to take on the Prime Cup final battle. And for those of you guys that are new to Pokemon Stadium 2, guess who it is? I will be your last opponent. Let's do it! And look who he's got on his team. A Mew. Just like the last guy in the Prime Cup in Stadium 1 had a Mew in both rounds, this guy does as well at the end of the Prime Cup. So, it all comes down to this. We are going to go with my my Heracross, my Suicune, this is tough, and uh, Rocky. So, can we do it? Alright, who's up first? Mew. He doesn't always lead with his Mew, but uh, he leads with it in this case. Alright. Come on, Megahorn. Alright, I, we get. I'm not sure we were faster than it. Got the Quick Claw to kick in, and was that Mew gonna go down in one turn? Almost! We almost had it down. Alright, let me see. Okay, 141. Alright, I'm not sure if I'm faster than it or if my Quick Claw is going to kick in. Um, I, uh, I, just, I really don't know. And I really want to save my Mega Horn, so we're going to go ahead and go into my Suic Suicune. Here comes a Pokemon Switch. Oh, it's Suicune! The opponent is weak. What an opportunity. What now? That was a glancing blow. All right, so we can take it down in one more hit. How will this newly switched out Pokemon fare? Which were faster. Right then, right, that's a hit. And that does it from you. 
Mario will bring out a new Pokemon. Oh, it's Starmie! Starmie! Alright, I'm expecting an electric type so move. Remaining Pokemon is three to two. This battle's outcome is still far from certain. So we are gonna go with a mirror coats. Alright, surf. Huh. What's this? It's no problem. So this will do double whatever he dealt to me. Which was pretty good, 100 damage. Go for it again. Alright, so Psychic. This does enough. Uh, it'll probably hang on by a bit. I don't think that was enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 21 hit points. A hot battle is unfolding. What will it do? The hit lands right off. So we should be able to finish it off with an ice beam. A blast of ice beam. Yes, it's a hit. There it is. Naka. And just one left. Just one Pokemon remains. Oh, it's Umbreon. Umbreon. This is the last Pokemon. Well, as I said, that is definitely what my uh, my hair cross is going to be handy for. And I was trying to get a freeze, but I didn't get it. Pokemon is still capable of going up, but the other one looks tired. What's this? That did little damage. Alright, it's fine. All we need is one Mega Horn, and we will have this. It's a good job, Suicune. We're eagerly awaiting the appearance of the next Pokemon. It's up to you, Heracross. This Pokemon is rejoining the battle. The crowd's excitement is building from this heated battle. So one Mega Horn. Come on, can we do it? Would this be it? Out of there! Yes! So the Prime Cup has been cleared, and that does it for the Pokemon Stadium. The last Pokemon goes down. Whew, so yes, the whole entire stadium has been cleared. So here comes the round one finale. That's disappointing after all the time I spent training. So here you go with the roll call. Alakazam, Suicune. I didn't even get to use Charizard. Right on. Heracross. And Wigglytuff. So, there you go. Congratulations. That's my favorite trophy is the Prime Cup. So. So, yeah. So, as you see, we have cleared. Challenge Cup, Little Cup, Poke Cup, and then the Prime Cup. So... All the Pokemon Stadium has been cleared, so let's go ahead and back out of the stadium. Go back to the uh, main thing. And so we get that Odrio Game Boy, which will qu uh, get quadruple the game speed for uh, red, yellow, and blue. So let's go ahead and uh, confirm that. And then... Whoa. So what's this? Versus Rival. Rival awaits your challenge. Make it a hot, memorable showdown. So you will unlock this once you have cleared all of the Gym Leader Castle and the Kanto Gym Leader Castle, as well as defeated all of the Pokemon Stadium. So, uh... Let's see who is awaiting for us. Here. Let's go ahead and see. <gasps> 
It's silver! I didn't think you'd make it this far. Come on, let's settle this now. So that is going to do for this episode, and in the next episode, we're going to conclude round one with the final battle with our rival, Silver. So if you guys enjoyed this episode, don't forget to hit that thumbs up like button. So next time, we're going to be battling Silver in the round one finale. So until then, I'm Zephyr Sonic, and I will see you guys then. Goodbye.